Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie, and this is episode 59 of Ocean Block. And in this episode, we're going to increase our production. It's the main goal. <laughs> um, because in the last episode, I was trying to make a silicon um, singularity, the, the Project Red one. And yeah, I ran out of uh, the what you call the electrotine about six hundred in. <laughs> so um, what I did was I went to my sluice area and I added another. Uh, material stonework factory that produces sand and I put upgrade in it um, put some lava and water in it and it's good to go uh, it's producing sand uh, be whereas before I was only producing it uh, passively whatever sand would come out of <clears throat> this pulverizer would uh, go over here and get sifted as sand so that was all <laughs> the sand production we had so hopefully this will uh, increase our electrotine what um, what are we up to now it's up to 608 uh, so yeah it's coming in pretty slow uh, but it it will automatically uh, craft as it gets that electrotine. Uh, but another thing I wanted to work on uh, was our wood production because uh, sawdust is uh, only up to 181 and we're only up to 98 basic crates. Uh, uh, but the oak is, is staying around 500 so anytime it goes over it eats stuff but uh, uh, and turns it into strip logs there's three um, yeah and it keeps two stacks of oak slabs so that's cool I, I also turned on uh, I put in another stack of dark oak in here to process because uh, I see that there is a, a plastic singularity. Plastic singularity. And I could have been making that this whole time, uh, but I, I didn't know. I didn't know there was a plastic singularity. So I turned that back on and Put an upgrade in this guy to speed it up. Look, it's sucking all the water out. Oh. It's going so fast it sucked all the water out. It's waiting on the water. Um, I guess I could put some speed upgrades in there. Did I make recipe for that oh yeah oh that is so so good okay go in there oh there we go now it's gonna speed it up a little bit better nice <laughs> okay so that's that's cooking uh, and that should get us a lot I mean, this is slowly draining. Um, what else was there? We need more wood, and I was thinking of using one of these uh, compact machines, probably this one, just so I could fill it up, and putting a tree farm in it. A, maybe not a huge one, but uh, it 
can't be <laughs> slower than what I'm doing with the, the uh, botany pot, so. So let's see what MFR stuff. Oh, it's not my factory reloaded anymore. Um, that's always think of it in my head though. Okay, so what I would want... Oh, I know where it's at. Put it out here. So we have uh, a plant sower. Hydroponic bed, not piece it together. I think it's the gap. So we need some gold gears. I think, I think I had the stuff to make this. Uh, yeah, I was gonna make it. What did I do with the axis? Mm -hmm. oh, I had to remake those. low tech. <laughs> Alright, so we have a plant gap. Ooh, that was a quest. So 
what kind of stuff we're gonna need like some item pipes possibly Ooh, we only have two item pipes might need more than that first chest. No? Okay. Oh no, I'm missing blaze rods. Oh, oh, there's a dog barking outside of my apartment. Okay, so blaze. Blaze. Um, I think in the multi servo press, it will compress them. Uh, but then I'll have to pull out a few that are left. Because uh, it will just sit there and clog up the system. Doggy. All right. Um, yeah, why not? Um, so, I'm thinking, oh, I should have grabbed like some dirt. Dirt. There's not a dirt singularity, huh? Um, I think I want an elevator. I'm hoping jump my way up uh, to get to the next part. So um, we'll make spawning point over here. Boop. And put the elevator here. And we'll want enough headroom for trees to grow. What? Oh, <laughs> I didn't know that that would do that. Uh, so apparently if you, if you have a block in your hand, it opens that up. this uh, this container before compact machine so I'll have to jump load it there we go There. <laughs> and to figure out which to shift or not to shift. Now, I don't think 
that this will uh, spawn mobs in here, so I don't think the light matters. I think it's always this light level. Boop. So that should be enough, hopefully. See, I don't think F7 is not um, doing anything in here, so. And this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine tall, so that should be plenty tall for trees to grow. Um, I don't think we'll use the whole thing. Maybe we should uh, make this part back here. where I want the plant sower. Uh, but I guess I can put dirt on top of it as well. Yeah, that looks about middle. So one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. So that's middle. Uh, but right now this guy doesn't have any upgrades and we need to figure out what's the highest one we want. Uh, is six. So if you show the working area, that's only one. one spot. So, and then we need the plant gatherer. Boop. You're facing the wrong way. There. And he's only doing one spot. Uh, but setting this up should be easy now that um let's see we'll need like a chest i'm trying to think if it's necessary or just go straight to an ender chest uh, but i can't feed the system because we're in an alternate dimension and we don't have access to it. So that's stinky. Uh, we could do this in the overworld, I guess. Uh, but the, the barge area is sort of transformed into uh, the botany pot area. So we basically want uh, this guy and that guy are also going to need power. Um, problem solved. And it's cheaper to, to use an ender gate by itself uh, than it is to hook, hook the cables up to one. Because it uh, basically this is one cable. Whereas if I were to run cables from here to here, uh, that's many more. Um, 
So I think, whoa, well, I think I might put it back here. I can still get behind it and stuff. Uh-oh, I think I just crashed. 